I tried this in the first day, but I really want to continue to see how I actually feel about this. But one of my faves of the collab genre, now for me, alongside probably my favorite... Probably what I think is the best unit from this collab, Rudius. Both human, full human team, full collab team as well. I think we're gonna do pretty good here. So, for each skill a human uses, you get the um, the stacks, including stances. Like, not, doesn't have to be attack skills, right? So that's pretty good for uh, for now for me here. All right, seal their healing. We're gonna be protecting Rudius, which I think is very important because for human teams here, the only protector we have is Arthur. And he's good, but I think he, he's kind of extended his welcome in the meta. Like, you can see that he can kind of get demolished, even with the damage reduction. And he doesn't do any damage, right? Like, now for me, pops off. Oh, it will remove the ignites, but I have to attack. Is what it is. Is what it is. It will remove the ignites though, so no extra damage. Because it's gonna cleanse. Yeah, I didn't have to do all this. Missed the crit! Huh. So I'm using Kyo because, you know, full collab. Could use Arthur for even like more protection, but I think that's kind of redundant. Um so Kyo it is. And then Zaldris, green Zaldris in the back. Because Zaldris is giving defense to our now for me, which we want. But also, you know, still giving attack to our other characters. Because, you know, if we went, you know, too much on the direction of one, the other wouldn't be getting enough, if that makes any sense. Alright, Rudy has two balls. Can you just do the deed with only two balls? Ah, definitely, he's solo. Now for me again, I think still one of the most underrated releases ever. He's still so good. I know he's underrated mostly because people don't care about Shield Hero. You can say in a way also the same about this collab. People are going to underrate Rudius a lot, I feel like. Um, but you know. Anniversary is coming up, so I cannot, <laughs> I cannot blame people for blocking out of their minds that they want to summon for this banner. Another team I want to do with Rudius is um, mono red humans. Would be like using, uh, you know, Arthur, Reinhard, Rudius, and Twigo in the back. If not Reinhard, then Bon. I think Bon might actually be better, but I don't know. Might do both in one video. Just to make sure we we get the all encompassing. Let's uh, not waste Rudius Rudius cards and just go in like this with two Kyo cards to get three balls. So then next turn we can just immediately do a big attack with Rudius. All right. Uh, we can break the shield. The problem I have with this unit is that, let's say, right, he was like Askenor, where every hit he does is big damage. I could break the shield and then double single target. But after I single target once, he loses all the balls and then his damage is garbage. No shield, though. There is, a fi I think, a fault with the unit. Design. Design-wise, it's like... Unfortunate that's how he's designed, but it is what it is. Ah, uh, I was really hoping that would still kill. Was a little ambitious though, should have gone for level 2. I wanted to uh, kill and then start working on the next ball cycle. <laughs> the next uh, magic orb cycle by attacking with. Uh, with now for me. Just weird. That would sure would have killed though, and then he would have gone into the revive. No! That's alright. 
Shield. That will double kill. For sure, double kills. Yep. Now, for me as a protector, is also like great because people are scared to attack him. Like, Arthur does remove your ultimate gauge, which is inconvenient. But now, for me, if you give him five stacks, the man flies. Truly nuts damage. Alright. Okay. I was w wondering when that was gonna happen. Um. I can't kill both. I'm gonna kill you. Again, if he could, I think maybe the his own AoE could break the shield and then double single target. But not how the unit works. You need to regain the balls to then do damage again. Inconvenient, but not necessarily bad. Okay. You got your stance, I got mine. Let's just go in again with uh, this right here. I'll go. I'll do a little bit of sealing as well after that hit. So his Ascaron just doesn't full heal. Also again, not doing the attack before Kyo. Ideally, you'd want to in fact the beginning of the turn so the follow-up attacks wouldn't get healed by Tarmail Link, but because of the balls, you know, I dig with Kyo first, get the ball, and then do it. Um, would be great to face some real players here and there, but you know, sad rally. Um, I even need to kill the end. Yes, I, I do. I was thinking maybe I just, just skipped the whole turn altogether. Man, he's missing all the crits. That's kind of nuts. Like, at, f at five orbs, he has plus 75% crit chance. Okay, we're being lowered by 10 here, or 15. So plus 60% crit chance. That's still like one, 150, I think. Okay, yeah, 150, that's a 50-50 chance. Because Dan has like about 100% crit resistance. Fair enough. That's like a 50-50 of critting. Kyo, thank you for... Uh, getting all the cards. Much appreciated. Yeah. He doesn't have the most crit chance. It's... Uh, because I, the idea is that you will get the crit chance with the balls. So you, his base stats didn't need to have that much crit chance, I guess. Alright, Kyo. Get more cards, baby. Let's get level 3 single target for you. That's fine. Oh, he doesn't have to. I have Tarmiel Link on Kyo, because, like, I don't want him to die. But maybe I should put on now for me. That's alright. I'm not even gonna risk it. Um, that will be five balls, then he attacks. Whoever survives. Which should be just Askunar. No stance card the whole match. I love when that happens. A hey, crit finally. Goddess team. I guess Archangel team. Not just simply Goddess. Yeah, I'll do both Kyo cards here. Get the two balls out of the way. Or three with the stance. Then I can just 
AoE, single target, that will kill Mile for sure. He will lower my damage, and there's nothing I can do about that. But it is what it is. Not gonna... Um, not gonna go for a level 1 this time. Because he might, he might miss the crit. Like, with all this damage reduction, it's like... Alright. No stance. That's fine. Hopefully, five balls can kill. As like the peak of his damage. So much damage reduction. I don't think this kills actually. So close. Kill will finish it off. Nice. That was still like so much damage. O okay, he comp. Okay, is it level 3 Marga blue card? No shot. And he had extra HP as well. It's still so much damage for how much damage reduction he has and like how much HP he had comparatively, you know? Kind of crazy. Yeah, he's gonna kill my Rudeus. I would have gone for it now for me. Oh, it's not 6-6. Six, six. It is 6-6. Six, six. It just did no damage. Okay. Well. Um, I have options. I'm going to save the Naofumi one. Naofumi is being chilling. Not gonna seal them because you know I'm disabled, but still did damage enough that I would life steal some. Attack me. Give me more stacks. No Tarmiel link, but the defenses would be good enough. Yep. Alright, Tarmiel. You got the ult, so you're the victim of the ult. Solid 1 mil ungeared. Oh man, if I had like a full... Maybe I should have put blue gill. <laughs> Can only target her, that's fine. Maybe I should have put blue gill, man. Does you have Tarmel Link? Yeah. Again, I mean, I should have actually sealed first. I didn't do that much damage anyways. It's gonna be an immensely tanky team, so... Not much you can do about that. Stance removal, by the way. He's gonna... Would he bother removing my stance now, though? Doesn't matter that much. My stance. It doesn't really matter all that much. <laughs> like, like remove the stance and attack Rudy or something? It actually... Huh. I say actually it kind of does matter because flood but he did that which was interesting was definitely interesting minus 30 can I still kill wow maybe I should have kept Tarmia link on <laughs> now for me Yikes. Yikes. That was a level 2 as well. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm just dead. Now for me, dead. Bye, now for me.
pretty awful damage. Um, uh, not gonna have five balls, but you know. Have to try. She got Tarmia, uh, not Tarmia, she got a freaking Nanashi every turn. Yikes! Yikes! Last match. Yeah, being lowered. Rudius kinda sucked. Damn. That was very sad. Because, like, that was his peak damage. Right? And then after he does his peak damage, he takes so long to get it again. I couldn't do it again. Because he takes so many attacks to get the peak damage again. Very sad. Hmm. It's like... Um... Level 1, hope it kills. Bro. <laughs> yeah, this is not it. This is most certainly not it. When he was finishing people off, he was doing a much better job. It's like when you when you use him with Askenor, and Askenor is getting people low and then he finishes. It's cool, but like when he has to actually kill someone, he fumbles hard. I have no stance. Please kill him. Please kill him. I need a stance. Oh, but then I lose the 30%. Oh. No stance. Thank you, Kyo. Thank you very much. This is kind of sad, honestly. Kind of shit. Oh, he did do okay with Askenor, though. <laughs>